Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Shrikant and today we will be solving this problem of ACM ICPC team in hacker rank which is under algorithms and implementation category. So you are given a list of n people who are attending ACM ICPC world finals. Each of them are either well versed in a topic or they are not. Okay. So there are some topics and uh, each of them are either well versed or they are not. Find out the maximum number of topics a two number team. 2% team can know and also find out how many teams can know that maximum number of topics okay so suppose a b and c are three different people then a b and b uh, like a, a b and b c are counted as two different teams okay they do not have to be disjoint okay so the number of p people can be 2 to 500 and the uh, number of topics can be in from 1 to 500 okay so the sample input is like say four number of people are there and five topics are there and these are uh, one indicates that uh, the person is well versed in that topic and zero indicates that he is not well versed so basically we have to find out all possible teams of size two okay two person teams such that uh, they are they know a uh, uh, as maximum topics as possible so if we look carefully here so the maximum that can be uh, possible out of a two person team is by combining the person one with person three okay then we will get all the five topics and also person uh, three with person four okay these are the two possible combinations in which we get five topics for all the others it will be lower than five topics so it's a very simple problem only the input taking part is already given where we are taking the number of people as n and m as the number of topics and we are creating a vector uh, of strings of the uh, topics that are watched by each uh, person in a string okay so this will be basically one line of the array okay this two dimensional array now uh, this is taken as input from the standard input now we have to compute uh, all the possible combination of two two person teams such that the number of topics is uh, maximum so what we will do is if we bitwise or the bits of uh, topics for two person and see if uh, see the number of ones in the output we will get the total number of topics the two person team are versed with okay so we'll have to calculate bitwise or for each possible combination of two person that is our out of all these four persons we have to choose two persons out of four and calculate the bitwise or of that topics of those persons fine so for uh, int i equal to 0 i less than n i plus plus for int j equal to i plus 1 j less than n j plus plus so this will give the all possible combination of two percent teams okay so we have to find bitwise or of topics of i and topics of j since these are passed as strings we cannot use the bitwise operators we have to write our own bitwise operator okay bitwise function which should return us a string bitwise or string topic one string topic two okay now what we will do is for i equal to zero i less than 
topic of large size since both the topics uh, all the topics are the same size okay i plus plus and we will do a bitwise or of each bit so let us first declare a string variable for output okay and then we will uh, do output of i is equal to topic 1 of i equal to equal to 1 or topic 2 of i equal to equal to 1 so if either of the bit is 1 then the answer will be 1 right otherwise the answer will be 0 okay so after this loop we will get the output uh, string which is the bitwise order of both the topics and then we will return this string okay simple enough after that what we first uh, here uh, we have to resize the out, uh, this output string to the size of uh, the topic variables in this case it will be 5 okay so that will be topic dot size okay so we will get this in a variable uh, and after this what we will do is uh, we will have to uh, basically instead of uh, returning the string what what we can do is we can return the count of the number of topics in this maximum known topics by this 2 percent team so we will not return the uh, output variable we will simply return uh, the count of the number of ones okay so for that what we will do is we'll copy this okay and then we will uh, if output of i equal to equal to 1 then count plus plus say let us declare a variable int c equal to 0 ok this will count the number of uh, topics that are watched this, this by this 2 percent team after that we will return this count ok instead of returning the whole topic that will be uh, cheaper after that and uh, this should uh, st store this result in a vector vector of integers and we will call this as uh, max topic vector okay and the size will be uh, the total number of uh, we do not have to declare the size we'll use the pushback operator of the vector to simply uh, dot push back this will uh, give you the number of topics of this particular pair i and j okay and after this we basically have for each two percent team we have one uh, integer value in this max vectors okay max vector so uh, we have to find the maximum number of topics right so for that what we will do is we will sort this 
max vector dot begin dot end so this will basically give and we have to do this in a uh, sort the array in the uh, descending order for that we'll use this standard uh, library function to sort it in the reverse okay in decreasing order generally if you don't give this parameter it will sort in ascending order which is by default less which is by default this thing less of integer okay but we have to sort in descending order so we will use this function okay after that what we will do is we have to uh, print the maximum topics known that can be known by a two person team and how many t of teams exist which know that maximum number of topics right so for that we will create a we will basically count the all the values starting from uh, which are same in the starting of the array okay since the maximum is in the front of the array the num so in this case uh, there will be two fives in the array after the sorting so that will basically give you the count to count that what we will do is for int i equal to 0 i less than n sorry i less than max vec dot size i plus plus uh, it should start from one okay if max vector of i equal to uh, is not equal to max vector of zero then we have to break okay we have found the different element which is not equal to the maximum element we have to break otherwise we keep on uh, proceeding so we'll output the max vector zero okay which is the maximum number of topics that can be known and the number of teams which is basically i okay fine so to iterate again out of uh, first we have to find the bitwise or of all possible two percent teams okay and after and this bitwise all will return us basically the total number of topics that is watched by to that that team okay in terms of the count we will store this in a very uh, vector and after that we will sort this vector and find the maximum value at the beginning and the number of teams having th that maximum value which is the total number of uh, teams having the same topic uh, watched fine let's try to run this sample test case oh, here we have to give end line okay let's run this code okay so there is a expected token before okay there is a comma here instead of semicolon here also and it it should be not topics it should be topic okay. Okay, here 
now we have to provide a break once the maximum value is different from the initial first element okay so the sample test case has passed let's uh, submit the code So all the test cases have passed successfully. Uh, it's a bit trickier here. Uh, you have to find to find the all the elements having the maximum value. Okay, which will be from the starting of the elements. Okay. Thank you for watching and share this video if you like this video and uh, do subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.